YouTube channel. So today, as you can probably tell by the title of today's video, if I'm honest with you, I don't really know why I literally start every single video like that, but we're rolling with it now because it seems to be a running theme. But basically today, me and James are off to Ikea because I mean, you'd probably seen by now, I know I keep going on about it a lot in these videos, but it's just really, really exciting for us. And it's kind of just like a big step in kind of like moving forward just being us two kind of thing but we basically bought a house like i said you are probably aware of that and if you haven't seen it yet then definitely go and check it out i'll link it at the top and i'll also link it in my description box down below just that it's super super easy for you to be able to find in case you haven't seen it yet but i reckon you probably have but anyway getting back to today's video we're basically off to ikea today because we basically have ripped the whole house out which you'd probably seen one out as well if you haven't then go and check that video out as well but we've basically ripped the whole house apart i've ripped it right the way it back to the walls and basically the kitchen's completely gone so we're basically going to ikea today to hopefully find a new kitchen so i thought you know what i might as well bring her along with us and we'll just vlog the whole journey like i said me and james both going to oh, i'll show you him when we're in the car on the way or once we actually get there but yeah that is basically where we're going today guys so yeah hopefully you'd like the kitchen that we choose if we decide to show you when we're there i mean i'm sure we probably will but i mean i'll bring you along anyway so you can kind of see what kitchens they actually have to offer but yeah enough of me rambling on let's go so we have basically just got to ikea we've come to the one at lakeside in case any of you are kind of wondering or you recognize it. it's basically the ikea at lakeside james has already got his kind of mask on. i've got one here we have both got gloves each as well just to make sure that we're he's got green one green ones blue ones. blue ones i've just got clear ones so we're going to be super super safe but obviously when we vlog in there we're going to have them on just because i mean we want to be safe and we don't really want to catch anything we shouldn't be really so yeah we're basically here i'll bring you in and take you in with us but yeah let's go guys so this is actually one of the kitchens that we have just seen yeah, it's basically just white with a nice little kind of brown worktop sorry if you can't hear me that well we've basically got masks on haven't we james he is loving it, honestly. He can't wait to continue kitchen shopping. We don't actually think we're going to go for white, though, do we? No. We're thinking maybe grey? Off, off white grey. Off white grey, just to make it a little bit different. But obviously, this one we're showing you is white because we're just trying to get some ideas for the minute, really. But we quite like these kind of ovens that are, like, in the middle of the... Um, not cabinet, but, like, kitchen unit. We like them at this kind of height. So I feel like we probably need to design it at some point. But yeah, oops, sorry. I think we're just right behind me. But yeah, is that a built-in fridge? We don't need one of them because we've got a built-in fridge. Not built-in fridge, we've got a fridge freezer. But yeah, we're thinking maybe something. Because our kitchen's quite small, as you can see, but this is one of the options that they actually have here. The only other thing that we will say is that we quite like how these... Oh, I'm not even showing you. We quite like how these um, drawers and stuff don't have handles and they just kind of like pull out. Just because we feel like, I don't know, it's a bit more like easy to wash. Not that handles are like difficult to wash. But we quite like how they're just kind of like pushing, pull out kind of kitchen, if that makes sense. This is actually kitchen number two that we've just seen. James has actually... Already had enough. He hasn't had enough yet. He's just taken a little IKEA. cue. He loves Ikea, really. We love Ikea. What are you chatting about? I might just take this off and catch something. <laughs> don't say that. But yeah, we're actually looking at this one. We did actually see one similar to this online, didn't we? But we're not sure if this colour here is slightly darker than the one that we saw online. Although, this is the sink that we actually saw online that we put in our kitchen when we designed it on our online. Because it just looks super, super sturdy. What do you think? But yeah, let us know what you think about this sink down below. But yeah, we've literally... It's quite nice on the grey, but I feel like the cupboards that we saw were slightly lighter than this online. But we're not entirely sure. But this is the sink that we both really really love so this color here is actually more the color that we was looking at online i feel like it wasn't with these handles though not at all we don't like black handles at all but i feel like this is more the color just for like a color reference in case any of you were kind of wondering it's definitely not this kitchen though is it what? it's not this kitchen that we picked out no not at all but this is kind of like the color i don't even know if it looks any different on here to the other color hopefully it does otherwise i'm gonna look like a bit of an idiot just showing you this but this is kind of the colour guys. So this is basically the colour that we actually really really like. It's like a high gloss light grey like it basically says. We basically just need to rebuild the kitchen while we're here. Hopefully it's all going to fit in. 
I know James is literally suffocating in these masks. These but masks are rubbish. This is the colour that we really like, but it doesn't have the pull out bit on it, so we're gonna need to get handles for it. The pull out ones are down there and they're like dark and grey actually. I'll quickly show you just in case you was wondering. So these are basically the ones that we were showing you around the other side that don't need handles because you can just pull them out. This one we actually quite like, but it's not high gloss, so I mean we feel like it's gonna be harder to kind of like wipe down. This one is, but we don't really want a white kitchen, and so is this one. And James said that this colour looks old. Beige. Beige. He says it's what old people have, so we're not going to go for that one. We're going to go for the high gloss one down there. Well, no, I'm insulting them on you. You're video. not insulting them Fantastic. at all. It's just your own personal insulting the preference. Elderly. You're not insulting the elderly at all. But yeah, this is basically the one down here that we're going to go for, guys. This is the colour that we think is going to be the winner, really. These are the current worktop kind of patterns that they've got in here. So we're just picking out one of these and then we need to design it when we get home because they're basically the machines that are them. One of them's turned on, but apparently we can't use them here anymore because they're shut off. So we need to design it again when we get home, don't we, instead? Yeah. James is honestly thrilled that we drove all this way and we can't even do it here, but oh well. Oh well, it'll be worth it once we've got the kitchen. But yeah, these are basically the worktops that you can choose from. So we're, we're on to taps now. Do you want to start again? No. We're basically <laughs> on it to taps now, and James is honestly loving this. We're currently deciding between what tap we want to go for. Do you prefer a round or a square looking tap? I don't know, it's a tap. <laughs> as long as water comes out of it, I'm delighted. He is honestly buzzing, but there's so many options. Like, honestly, it's blowing my mind. And James is like, just pick one because I don't really care what kind of tap we're going to go for. Up, let's just get gold. Let's I be mean, one of them people. Let's not get gold. I feel like gold's like hard as a clean. What do you all think? Back as you're watching this, you think gold's hard as a clean? I just feel like let's stick with like a classic silver tap. I don't think the Queen's probably got a gold one, but then again, I don't know. But I quite like this one because it's like quite, it's not like round like the other ones, if you know what I mean. I mean, it's still round, but it's more squarer. What one's your favourite? Come on, you must have a favourite. James is honestly loving Ikea and he can't wait to build the kitchen when we get in, can you? Buzzing. He honestly cannot wait. But yeah, just in case any of you are wondering, this again is the sink. And they've got this like kind of contraption thing on it, which I think is quite good. I think it's called a draining tray. The draining tray for like all of our draining cutlery. Needs. But yeah, this is basically the sink again in case any of you are wondering. We're just picking a tap to go on it. And then we're going to take a picture of it so we know which one it is when we get in. So we have actually come out from Ikea now. James is so glad that we're out, honestly. Now we've got our face mask so we can actually breathe properly. I didn't realise how, like, they make you just hot, don't they? A lot of my foundation is on the back of my one, though, so we know which one's mine and which one's James. But, yeah, honestly, we come out of there. Didn't actually end up getting anything because, basically, what happened was we went to use the, like, the computer thing to just double check what sizes we need just to be like 100 percent sure and the woman said to us that you can't use them at the moment even though they've got the like is it ppe the screen they've got like screens up around the computers to make them like two meter friendly i suppose a bit like they have in tesco but they didn't have apparently you just weren't allowed to use them so we're going to go home and double check the measurements and then we're actually going to order it online now so yeah james is honestly thrilled that we came all the way don't you it's very hot it's very hot but yes, yeah, so we're going to go home. I'll show you once we actually get home and we're able to order it. But we need to quickly run to being cute first. I won't bring you in there just because I mean this is basically in a Kia vlog. And I mean, I don't know if you're going to be interested in being cute. But yeah, so when we get home, we'll double check the measurements and then we will order the stuff or the kitchen. And yeah, hopefully it will turn up soon. And then once it's all fitted, we'll show you in kind of like the house update vlogs. But obviously, we kind of know what we want now. That We know that we want the colour. We definitely like that colour, so I mean it was worth it because we definitely know we want that high gloss light grey colour. So at least we know that we know what um what was it called? The handles. Are you really that hot now? We've got the windows open. I'm sitting in your car's like a sauna, it's ridiculous. It's not that bad. But yeah, honestly, so we know what hands we want, we know what taps we want. So yeah, let me stop rambling on. Let's go home after we've been a being cute and then let's get older in it, eh? So yeah, we'll see you when we get home guys. So we've literally just sat here for absolutely what feels like ages and tried to design our kitchen. This is actually what we're thinking of. Now we know that these look like two different shades of grey on the laptop, but I mean we've double checked it and triple checked it and even quadruple checked it. And it actually says that the cupboard doors are the same colour, so we're not entirely sure if it's just the angle or whatever that we're looking at. 
but it's all the same color which is good so yeah we have actually managed to sort it we're just basically going to order it now and then hopefully it'll turn up soon we're not entirely sure when it's going to turn up or anything like that but you'll have to keep an eye out on the vlogs to see when it's going to get delivered and things like that if you want to see how it's looked and how it's built once we've actually got it and built it and kind of fitted it really so yeah i suppose that does kind of round off today's video anyway guys i know akia was kind of unsuccessful earlier but i mean hopefully enjoyed coming along with us regardless and i mean at least you still got to kind of see what kind of kitchen we're looking into getting or what we have all kind of ordered now so yeah i really hope you enjoyed watching it anyway guys if you did then please be sure to give this video a massive thumbs up and subscribe to our channel down below if you haven't already and do be sure to turn on the post notification bell button if you want to be first to be notified as to whenever we upload any other house related content or things like that because i mean it will definitely be coming soon so i mean definitely stick around for that but that is basically all for today guys so until next time see ya